Hey everyone, Alex here. So while browsing the uh, web today, I found some pretty cool new features for NVIDIA RTX cards, uh, one of them being RTX Voice. Uh, so if you haven't heard about this yet, uh, it's essentially, um, it uses the RTX cores in your uh, RTX graphics card uh, to improve voice quality as well as like block background noise, which is really cool uh, by using AI and things like that. So. Uh, I'm going to give everyone a guide on how to install it as well as a quick demo to, so you can see if it's, you know, if you think it's worth installing for yourself. So uh, all you have to do, link will be in the description, uh, and essentially you would just download right here, download the app. So we, uh, we already did that. Let's open it up. I'm hoping with a newer version of uh, GeForce Experience it will already be, like, installed. Um, it won't have to be, like, a whole separate thing. And here we go. So we'll agree. That was easy. Okay, uh, so after it's installed, you'll see this. Um, essentially, how to make sure everything's set up properly and everything's working right. Just go here, uh, make sure the input device, I only have one, uh, but you'd want to make sure it's like not on your webcam or any other microphone it might be. Um, output device, you, you can leave the same. Um, so what we'll do next is we're going to go to sound settings. So... In this case, I don't want to turn it on yet, but how you would turn it on is you would change this and go to Microphone NVIDIA RTX Voice uh, for both of these. So um, that's how you would change it in settings, and that would be, you're pretty much good to go. Now what I'm going to do next is um, I'm going to turn this, I'm going to give you guys a demo with it off and then with it on. So I'm going to disable like all the OBS features, and we're just going to use RTX Voice. So one minute for that demo. Okay, uh, so this is the demo with it turned off. This is non-RTX audio, so let's pretend like you're clicking. So I'm clicking my mouse around. You know, you're, you're 360 no-scoping, and then let's do the keyboard too. So you're typing. You're trying to have your nice Discord call with your friends, and they just all they do is hear your keyboard. This isn't even me over-exaggerating. I just have a really loud uh, mechanical keyboard, so... And, uh, yeah, so that would be without RTX audio. So let's go turn it on now. Okay, so this is with RTX audio on. Now, the first thing you want to make sure is if you're using something like OBS, make sure uh, it's essentially the microphone is selected as microphone RTX voice. And let's go back to sound settings. And then just make sure uh, for microphone RTX voice for input. Um, the other thing to note is you might want to change this after when you're not using RTX voice, because uh, technically if you wanted to just, you know, talk with friends and things like that and didn't want to run RTX voice, you would actually uh, not hear anything. So make sure you, you have this selected, but you also have to make sure the program's open. So that will be uh, the first thing. So let's do the same test as before. Uh, let me kind of just close all this out. Um, so we're going to do the clicking. Yeah. Your 360 no scoping again, and then we're gonna add the keyboard with the clicking. So, example, you're talking with your boys, you're trying to get that dub, um, and you know, your viewers usually would be having a hard time hearing you because all you'd be doing is slamming your mechanical keyboard. So, and I'm, I'm essentially, I'm clicking the same, and I am, uh, I'm anything, I'm being slightly rougher with the keyboard, not being the same, but yeah, no. So this will be the demo for that. Okay, uh, and that is my demo for NVIDIA RTX Voice. I think it's pretty cool. It's still in beta, so there is room for an improvement. They can make it even better than what it is right now. Uh, you could slightly still hear um, items within, like for example, like you could still hear my keyboard and mouse a little bit. Uh, but it definitely was a lot cleaner. There was like no background noise whatsoever. Um, and it really depends on your mic too, right? So like I have, um, this is using a... Sennheiser, like a, just like headset. It's called the GSP 600. Um, and it honestly cleaned up the audio quite a bit. So I think it's pretty cool. Try it out with your microphone and your setup because your results may vary. Uh, and post them in the comments below. Let me know how it's working for you. So if you have any, qu any questions, feel free to comment. And thanks for stopping by. Have a good one.